sometimes we used to feel a slight electric shock from our refrigerator. The reason is not a fault or a very high current. It's a very small measurable current that flows through our body due to the two reasons that is a capacitive coupling or the poor earthing. I shock is equals to V touched by our body. What is this? This is this is the slightly very very small shock current which is responsible, which is the one which is the culprit. I is equals to V by R, Ohm's law. And hence I shock is equals to V touch by our body. I shock is the current flowing through our body. V touch is the voltage our body feels. Our body is the body's electrical resistance. So this is what AC voltage is equals to 230 volt. Body resistance is equals to 3000 ohms. Insulation resistance that is bed wire moisture is equals to 7000 ohms. Calculation V touch is equals to 230 into 3000 by 3000 plus 7000. It is a simple formula that is a voltage division rule. It's equals to 230 into 3 by 10 is equals to 69 volt or approximately 70 volts you can say. That lands on our body that is enough to cause pain or involuntary reaction. Capacitive coupling current. That is the formula I is equals to 2 by F C V where F is frequency, C is capacitance, V is voltage. V coast is equals to 2 by F into C stray into V A C. That is I coast that creepy little current you can say which we can't see but feel. C stray is the tiny capacitance between the wire and the metal body. V A C that is standard 230 voltage AC and F that is frequency usually about 50 hertz. Ghost is not a fake, it's just an invisible current jumping through the electrical fields. If going through the formula, I is equals to 2 pi F C V, putting the values we get I is equals to 2 pi into 50 into 50 into 10 to the power of minus 12 into 230. It is around uh, 3.6 micro amperes of displacement current flows, which is very very tiny. But it is there. If there is no proper grounding, it builds up on the body and discharges through our 